Hi everyone, I'm Sasha J Reacts. I'm back with another reaction video. Today we'll be watching episode 5 of X-Men 97. So let's dive in. Previously on X-Men. Mr. Sinister, you are your son, Nathan. It's a techno-organic virus strain, and the virus is already spreading rapidly. What if there's a cure in yours, Bishop? This man only got enough juice for Nathan and I. Meaning, we can't go with you. My next life will be mine. Take care. Jean. Call me Madeline Pryor. Charles Xavier entrusted me with his dream, and it does not ask you to love or embrace my kind as your own. We will begin. Magneto stands on business every time. Into the United Nations. Maybe we should take a page from the professor's playbook and give Eric a second shot. Do you think your team would still trust you if they knew? Oh, is it going to be revealed this episode that they're smashing? It's so obvious. Was it caused by atomic testing? Or is it nature herself deciding the time has come to change the human race? Some, some call them monsters. Oh, they're talking about the mutants. Planet, they are known as mutants. Blue blushes too, my dear. Here in Westchester <laughs> County sits an unassuming English estate. The X-Men's home. A school for mutants founded by the late Professor Charles Xavier. Not like regular boring classes. More hands on. I'm still on not used to know Professor X. Empire this Dinosaurs. is crazy. For many of the X Men, Xavier's school is the only home they've ever known. People who have fallen through the cracks, forgotten. I used to want to be a mutant but so bad when I was worldwide younger. Worldwide today, as the UN formally admits the mutant nation of Genosha. Like when I was this younger. Gambit. The X-Men were number one. The new Blackbird sufferer. And no, then it was Fantastic Four and so on and so, on and so forth. Gravity would most certainly be an issue. Damn it, you roosters. Look at your head. Hey, y'all. They be busy doing a bit of renovating since Gambit's last visit. Not they have Gambit third willing. That's so messed up. They were mentioning Genosha. I'm sorry, Genosha episode. I forget what it was for. Genosha like mutant home. A mutant territory. Yo, wouldn't it be funny? Why are they showing that aircraft? Wouldn't it be well it wouldn't be funny, but wouldn't it be crazy if they dropped a freaking bomb on Genosha or something like that? Oh, that's the X-Men's aircraft. My needle was right. My friends. Well, would you look at you, girl? A lot of smiles at the mansion when we heard Madeline Pryor scored a top spot among Genosha's brass. With an X-Man. Luckily, you guys could spare a gene. I stood on coming after Rogue agreed to join me at the gala. I confess, the Master of Magnetism was surprised to receive an invite bearing the United Nations seal. Yeah, I hear it's called the future. Magneto, the Interim Council would love a word with you before tonight's gala. Privately, if possible. So where the heck does that leave us? Dang. Isn't that Nightcrawler? We yeah. shall play tourist as the council speaks with Magneto. Bert joined the council to help work with Genosha's various communities of faith. Things to see. Such wonders in this city. Long as he left those faithful killer I wonder are we going to see Quicksilver. I really oh, like him. tongue, Gambit. You remain as always. We have much to discuss since our gothic adventure amid the Alps. Come, everything around us would not have been possible without the work of the X-Men. Oh my, it's just like he said it'd be. Who, the professor? More than a place, a home. Dad is charging me. Honey. Well, maybe Gambit's willing to ask questions no one else will. Like, why is Magneto suddenly mutant MVP? I wish I could make clones. One to go to class for me, so I can stay in bed all day. That, that would be clutch. Your poker face is very poor. Hey, mind your beeswax, Fogo. Ah, you Americans, so theatrical. Life is violins and close-ups. I blame soap operas. Why Just would he even come? Love is best measured in what we forgive. I am here with Scott Summers, also known as Cyclops. Scott, are you surprised to see such a bold move in world politics? Well, if being an X-Man teaches anything, Miss Tilby, it's to expect the unexpected. I always kept that in mind as field leader. Those shades are weird at the lights. Can you take them off? I can't. 
Sorry. I forgot he definitely I'm can't sure take off his freaking glasses. I hear you're the X-Men's power couple. Because Love if he does, galaxies. So everybody gets lasered. When did you know she was the one? Which one? Because there's two. You're skipping the questions, too. Hard to interview someone who can't tell which parts of her memories belong to her and which parts belong to her clone. Even reacquainting myself with my psychic powers feels strange. Like the face of an old Gosh, Jean is so freaking powerful. Memory. This busted mug ain't changed in a hundred years, and you know it. I remember so many things. So many with Scott. The two lovebirds still ain't talking. He's grieving his son, although the way he's avoiding me recalls a time. This when I asked her to go out, like she didn't trust me. He was scared, afraid the phoenix had changed me. I wanted to reassure him. I wanted to show her. That, that Phoenix movie really wasn't that was bad. That's the only thing I know about the Phoenix movies in the movie. The of... Focused me. His eyes made me stay. Now. I know all about drowning in memories. Best to look up and keep paddling. Keep moving. Because the past will yank you under if you don't. You forget how many sunrises your eyes have seen. The only ever seen one of you, Red. Just the one. He still has a thing for her. What the freak? What? Logan, I'm... You're Jean Grey. He's Scott Summers. Those are the rules. You just forgot him for a second. Uh... Said. Now go talk to that overgrown boy scout. Strange. Uh... I saw hospital records for one Nathan Charles Summers, born to Scott and Jean Grey Summers, just last month. Born at Westchester Memorial. I spoke to a Dr. Bryan's there. Bro, she's doing way too much. That jerk wouldn't deliver my... He called my kid a freak. Scott, I came here today to give the X-Men a chance to show the world that mutants are just like us. People. Normal. And you lie. Why lie? Because, because he's going. Excuse me? I said because you're normal. You're ungrateful. We fight. Risk our lives for you. Evil mutants, robots, evil crazy Scott aliens. incoming. If this were nothing like you, thank God, because it's the only reason you people are still. Wait! Did he just say that? Nah, I love this show. It's a tear. Recent events have aligned themselves in an unprecedented fashion for our kind. With even the most Who the freak is this? Of us finally getting a voice. He we looked at like Logan for a second. Loudly, as one united community. This concerns me and my ex-Ben. How? We need a handsome jawline that begs trust and respect. A poster child king. Careful, Miss Frost. Don't go filling this man's head with such notions. Whose charitable idea was it to let a human be on the council? We're no others available to weep over semantics. <coughs> Moira's a fierce ally to mutants. And we all agreed Moira. on the title of Chancellor. I've heard that name before. You eclectic allotment of social climbers. Wish for me to rule Genosha. Hilarious. One could argue, and many sadly do, that none of us would be here today were it not for you and your publicity stunt. Are there no others better tempered to stomach the squabble of human diplomacy? But Charles be gone, Magneto. And I may not like it. But if Charles trusts you with his X Men, he trusts you with this. We Is he were really going to leave? In Germany when he first mentioned his dream, I laughed at him. Was he no way he'll leave the X-Men in Rojanusha. Both earn an early grave. He did that smile of his, that annoying secret smile. Magneto, any dream worth having is a dream worth dying for. We thought we'd perish before seeing the day when humanity accepted our people. Like Moses in the Promised Land. We would carry the dream, but never live it. Look, Magnus, I may not be Jean Grey, but I know what the professor would say if he was here. Time to dream bigger. You shall have me on one condition. I ought to knock you from here to the North Pole. You think making me your queen means we're getting back together? It is a what is happening? calculation, Rogue. Me, mutant kind's fiercest defender. And you, an X-Man whose touch allows her to feel anyone's pain. A true leader, an empathetic one. Was this your plan all along? Make everyone like you and then take the professor? I won't deny my passion for you. As with Gambit, loving you makes broken men whole so that even as you deny us, our heartache is not in vain. 
we would be lucky to have you. What we, is happening? There's so much going on. This is crazy. I can't believe I've lost it like that. Oh, Scott, anger is normal, even for mutants. Sometimes you just have to let go. There are some things worth holding on to. Describe him to me. Describe Nathan. I see him everywhere. In every face, on every street. So oh. I can't see color. But up here, I see these big brown Wait, eyes, Scott can't see color? Colored hair. It reminds me of... Of us. Don't tell me! You can explain! Who the freak is that? Is that other Jean? Jean! If you'll excuse us, Madeline. Something wrong, Miss Pryor? Sorry. Was she Mind just drift in indeed. her freaking head? Mind drift indeed. Communicating via psychic rapport was our thing, Scott. Just stop it. Let me explain, please. Explain what? I know what I saw. Jean, you... How long has it been happening? A month, maybe. I, I was checking in after she moved over. Wait, so he's yeah. been having Go to Genosha, telepathy with sex phone. with this woman? Oh, this is yeah. crazy. What you saw on the astral plane was confusion, Jean. Grief. She's the mother of my son. That's the one thing I can be certain about right now. Do you love her? This is I messy. Love both of you. Whole galaxies beckoned me, but I turned my back for you. Sinister cuts out a part of me, and you love it? He that didn't know. What music. is happening? The music's changing, and you need a chair. Leader, father, husband. And you? You don't trust your memories. Do you even love me? My love for you is the one thing I remember this amid this pain. This is insane. unnecessary. Remember or feel. Choose, Jean. Do not spin this on me. Do you love me, Jean? Or am I just a lovely memory? What is it? Who did Jean. that? What is it? What is happening? Who the? Who is this? Is that Gambit? Wasn't expecting. Well, I thought that was call. Nathan for a second. I don't know why. You best sit down. It was back after I ran away from my daddy. My evil mother was helping me with my powers. Said she knew a fella who could help, an associate. The man seemed nice enough, seemed to want to help. Just not like I thought. He spent weeks talking about how mutants... And then you let him hear you up. This is day. crazy. I would have never in a million years imagined that Rogue and Magneto would be smashing. Fashion. Dance. He showed me that being a mutant wasn't just about my power. It could be something more. And when we realized that his electromagnetic powers protected him from my touch, other things started happening. But then I started seeing the hurt in him, like raging waters. There wasn't enough room in our affair for his demons and, and mine. When I joined the X-Men, Eric said he wouldn't want me to lose another family. He acted like it never happened. We both did. You gonna accept his offer? If Genosha's shown us anything, it's that we don't need to be Wait, afraid. Wait, so she's really just mm. gonna leave Gambit? And, and it seems like he was there for her in the world, when he wasn't. <laughs> that's the whole reason I became an X-Man. You never wanted to make things official. I mean, she I does have that. a good point. She's doing I it for I played your share. All the expectations, every time, looking at you, seeing all the things I couldn't do. By telling Gambit the dang truth. I can't touch you, Remy. Your heart may beat for me, but feel it. You light up everything you touch, but never me. Something's Yo, this is sad. Things. Not this. I wager that fool will break your heart in two. Gambit always knows the odds. And she'll okay. come back running. In this game, you do. Till then, we be friends, Mona me. Just friends. Everybody's ending their freaking love triangle this episode. It's crazy. Why am I getting nervous? What's going to happen? This Genosha place is too bubbly. A drink from Are they going to get together? Dream change the fact that others be more. Assemble the council. We need to talk. Whatever What's happened? Doctor Cooper. Is it your dress? My former prosecutor has likely taken issue with your choice for chancellor. But surely Genosha's right to self-govern will not only be protected, but cherished, as it is with all UN nations. Most other nations don't allow a terrorist to be their leader. Yet so many allow their leaders to be terrorists. If it eases your mind, 
Magneto accepted only on the condition that we asked one of the X-Men to govern with him. Rogue. What did she say? Did she say yes? Is that Rogue? Oh gosh, is he gonna snap? Why are they doing this in front of him? The tension, I'm getting nervous. What is happening? Now this is too happy. Something bad has to happen. They have great chemistry. Wow, and Gambit could never experience that. What is that? What is it? What was that? Was that a premonition? Somebody told her to turn off the music. So she's not going to let them know what's happening? Somebody just said turn off the music. Thanks for dance, but many some things are deeper than skin. Wait, is she really about to walk away from Magneto? What is happening? Music, get everybody out. Who is that? What's going on? No way, I just said in the beginning that the wouldn't it be crazy if they bombed the- Wait, is that Nathan? So sorry. Sorry for what? What is going on? Bro, Nathan is a freaking adult. Why would they get me attached to these people just to kill him? Whoa. I'm upset now. So are you. Got it. How many? Too many. So. Go at it. You end up dead. Freaking Sentinels. We're trying to evacuate folks now. A promise was made. No. Is he about to die? I knew something bad was going to happen. I'm gonna have to edit that out. Got me crying. I draw its fire away from the gardens. Rogue clears a path for Gambit to the Morlocks. Save as many as you can. We shall not live oh our gosh. days wondering Magneto if we're gonna, gonna die. Is... My intuition never steers me wrong. I knew something bad was gonna happen. Who the freak is controlling these sentinels? It's probably the freaking government. Oh, they destroyed the freaking statue. knows Callisto will find us. If not her, Magneto. He promised Leech would never be scared again. The X-Men are no friends to the Morlocks. Are you kidding me when they're literally oh, dying yes. trying to save you? Bon soirée, Miss Ami. Now kindly follow me. I'm still stuck on the fact that Nathan was a freaking adult. An old man. And where the freak is Jean? Gosh, she's gonna die of me. The only way for Magneto to really, like, stand on business is if Rogue dies in front of him. I don't want it to happen, but if it does, that would be crazy. No way! Did it work? No! Too dangerous, Damn it, see your bed. And raise it! What is happening? I knew this was too happy. Why is this happening? Mutant intruder neutralized. The name's Gambit, on a me. Is he now controlling this? Remember it. How many? How many, damn it? Everybody died? For those just returning to us, regardless of your stance on recent world events. Oh my. The images you are about to see may be disturbing. This make me don't feel alive. He has to be. I can't kill you. I knew it started off too good to be true. For everything to just be nice and smooth. I don't even know where to start. I just know that Magneto better be alive next episode or we riot. This was a 10 out of 10 episode. I knew that something bad was going to happen. I just could tell. They did so good with the build up and the tension. <sighs> that was intense. It was definitely intense. I just, I don't even know what the freak to say right now. I feel heartbroken a little bit because Gambit was starting to really rub off on me he was a really good character so far this was a lot it was so good i just literally don't know what to say but what the freak if you would like to continue in this x-men 97 journey with me leave a like comment or subscribe click the links down in the description box below and i'll see you guys next time Bye.